What's good, y'all? Today I'm going to show you how to play Wanted by Alan Jackson. It's in standard tuning with a capo on the first fret. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for me and stuff. I appreciate it. This was a request. Um, I went. I tried to do it Thursday whenever I do my request, usually. Um, and it got copyrighted, so I thought I'd redo it for y'all. And if anybody else has any requests, let me know. And I'm going to do all my requests um, on Thursdays from now on, hopefully. But um, So it's in finger style. So since it's in finger style, your thumb is going to get the 6th, 5th, and 4th string. First finger 3, middle 2, and ring 1. The chord you're going to need is an A. 0, 0, 2, 2, 2, 0, 5th string down. D. Zero 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 two three two four string down and an E zero two two one zero zero all string. All right. Um, there's going to be a key change, and I'm going to show you a couple different options you can do for that key change. All right. It's after the first chorus. All right. So let me do your intro for you. This is going to be your intro right here. So that's going to be your intro. What you're going to do is going to start on an A chord, but you're going to play this A chord two different ways. So you're going to start off on the A and you're going to go 5, 3, 2, 3, 1, 3. And then after you do that on your regular A, bar from the fourth string down on the second fret with your first finger and put your pinky on the fifth fret of the first string and do the same pattern. 5, 3, 2, 3, 1, 3, all right? And you're going to do that two times for the intro. So this is your intro right here. All right, kind of. All right, but anyway, that's your intro. And then when the verse starts, it's going to go like this. <clears throat> for the first verse and then you don't have to worry about all that but um so your first verse you're going to start on an a and you're going to go five three two three one three and then you're going to go to a d and for your first verse you're going to play your d like this you're going to put your first finger on the third string second fret middle finger second string third fret and pinky on the fifth fret of the first string and do that same pattern Five, three, two, three, one, three. All right, so that's your D for your first verse. All right, then you're going to go back to A, regular A, and then the one with the pinky. All right, then you're going to go to an E, six, three, two, three, one, three. Start over and do that again. Alright, and then after that, you're gonna just, it's gonna be another verse before the chorus, and you're just gonna play the chords, the A and the D regular. Alright. So here's your first um, verse right here until you, until it kind of kicks in. So this is your first verse. A, B, A, A, B, A, 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 B. It's the same progression, but you're not going to have to do those fancy chords. You're just going to play it like this until the chorus. A. B. A. Hold on, 
let me see. All right, so let me start over. This is your second verse right here. I kind of was confused because I forgot something. All right, so here's your second verse. A. B. A. B. E, A. A. B. right here at this point all right um and so for the chorus you're gonna lead the chorus starts on an a well actually so this let me just play the chorus for you this is your chorus right here so the verse is going to end on an a and you're going to lead back into the a that is going to be the key change all right so anyway so right before the chorus you're going to be on an a at the end of the verse all right and then you're going to lead into the a by going all right so you're going to hit the open six string three second fret six string three fourth fret six string three all right then you're going to go to a on it, just hit that fifth string and hit the open fifth string. Good, second fret fifth string, hard, fourth fret fifth string, Ed, <laughs> and then D. One. I forgot the words, but um, all right, so let me just so I'm just gonna do the last progression of the verse so you can see how the lead in goes into the chorus. So this is your last verse right here before the chorus. the whole song there's going to be a key change but um i wanted to show y'all a couple things about this chorus so i already showed you the lead in for the beginning of it i already showed you that but um on that a um in the middle of the chorus you're going to lead in actually you're going to do some lead ins on that e too so let me just do the uh, chorus from the top so here's your chorus from the top. A. B. A. E. And so right here on this E, you're going to do it like this because you're going to lead back into the A. Six, three, two, three, one, three. And then hit six, three, second fret, six string. Three, fourth fret, three. All right, then you're gonna go to A. Five, three, two, three, one, three. All right, then open fifth string, three. Second fret, fifth string, three. Uh, fourth fret, three. And then go to D. All right, and that's how you do those lead ins. All right, so let me, this is your chorus all together. Um,
right here, there's going to be a key change right here at this point. All right, now, so you got a couple options right here. So for this key change, after the first chorus, you can either move your capo up two frets to where it's on the third fret and do everything um, like I already showed you, just with the capo. Everything I already showed you, but just with a capo for the key change if you want to do that. Or you can just throw your capo on the, I'm not going to do that, but you can throw your capo on the floor and just play a C instead of an A. Um, a D instead of a, hold on, oh my bad, an F instead of a D. And a G instead of an E. A C is 0, 3, 2, 0, 1, 0, fifth string down, but you're going to play it with your pinky on the, no you're not, never mind, fifth string down, you can play the little F if you want to do it this way, it's fine, 0, 0, 3, 2, 1, 1, fourth string down, and a G, either 3 or 4, 3, 2, 0, 0, 0, 3, or 3, 2, 0, 0, 3, 3. Right, and just replace those chords so the A so it'll go like this you know what I'm saying just replace the chords a C instead of an A F instead of a D and G instead of a um, E and just do the same pattern and same progression and everything. All right. So um, anyway, that is and was wanted. If y'all have any questions or something, let me know. And if anybody else has any requests, let me know. And I'll try to do them on Thursdays. Till next time.